In this video, I'm going to show you how to bind Blowfin to Google Authenticator. Let's get into the video. In order to withdraw assets off of Blowfin, as well as have a second layer of security on your account, you'll need to bind Google Authenticator. Now, if you don't already have the Google Authenticator on your phone, you can download it from the Apple App Store, and you can also get it off the Google Play Store. And it is a free download. So start out by downloading the app and installing it to your phone. To bind Blowfin to Google Authenticator, we'll come right up here to our profile icon, and then we'll click on Overview in this drop-down menu. Then over here on the left-hand side, make sure you're set to Account and Security. Right down here, you'll find the Google Authenticator option. Simply come over here on the right-hand side and click on Link. Then Blowfin will be showing you a QR code that you can scan with the Google Authenticator app in order to bind Blowfin to your Authenticator. Down below that, you'll also see a backup key. Make sure to write that backup key down and keep it somewhere safe. You can use that key to recover your account if your phone ever gets lost, stolen, or broken. But make sure no one gets their hands on that. So what we'll do from here is we'll open up the Google Authenticator app on our phone. Then at the bottom right, inside the Authenticator app, you'll see a little plus sign. Tap on that. Then you'll see two options, scan a QR code or enter a setup key. The easiest way is to scan a QR code, so we'll tap on that. Then simply hold your phone up to the screen and scan your QR code and then your authenticator code for Blowfin will be saved inside the app. If for whatever reason you can't scan a QR code, you would select the enter setup key option. Then under account name, give this account a name, so just call it Blowfin or whatever you want. And then in the your key box, you would type in your backup key that you can see below your QR code. Once you're done that, you tap on add, and that's the manual way to enter Blowfin into Google Authenticator. Once you've scanned your QR code, and written down your backup key. Just simply come down here and click where it says I've saved the backup key properly. Next, you'll have to send an email verification to the email that you used when you created your account. And then you'll have to put in your Google Authenticator code, which is generated inside your Google Authenticator app. And you'd type it into this box here. To get your email verification, just click right here on send. Put in your codes and then click on submit. And you'll have bound Blowfin to Google Authenticator. You'll see on the security page right here, that my Google Authenticator is now toggled to on. And there you have it. That's how you combine Blowfin to Google Authenticator. If you got some value out of that, don't forget to leave me a like and hit subscribe for future content. Also feel free to check out my other Blowfin tutorials, which I've put together inside a playlist on my YouTube channel. Thanks so much for coming by and checking out this video. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. And until I do, have yourself a powerful day.